What's that word you bapping with Bapperton? Hit that like button, subscribe, and share. EG. Yeah. What's that word? Billionaire. Right. Y'all know I ain't been bapping with Bapper, but today you're bapping with the Bapper, brother. Um, Yesterday, that was the day or yesterday? Yeah, you got picked up yesterday? Today. Today. Yesterday, um, OTF, DD, and a few other OTF associates got picked up for the murder of Lil Pop, Kondo Rondo, homie, and LA, and California. I don't know if it's LA, but I know it's California. Um, then, today, they turned around and went and grabbed Smurf. First off, I want to say, free all them innocent, man. Everyone is innocent and to proven guilty. You feel me? That's everyone that's law. Everyone is innocent to prove guilty. Um, they said OTF Jam wore wire for several years around OTF affiliates and was working with the police after he just came home from doing a 10 year bid. So he got caught with a gun or something like that. And after that, he just went in there and just got to sing. He didn't want to go back to jail. Um, Lil Durk got picked up for murder for hire. They said that the rentals and the flights was purchased with an OTF credit card. You feel me? You know, the LLCs, the business, they used all that. And now it's going around saying the paperwork's coming out that Lil Durk, the feds hacked the iCloud and Lil Durk is saying that do not book anything connected to or with in or on my name. You feel me? So that happened and they snatched him up. But at the end of the day, dude still wore white for several years. So that comes back to what conversations was held around OTF Jam. How much did Jam know? Was Jam actually on the hit? We don't know. We will find out on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z, brother. You feel me? Like, on um, which jail on no man I've been there. It's not a place for no human being at all, especially not a black man at all. You feel me? Um, it's nasty. It's disturbing. It's rough. It's, 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 it's treacherous. You feel me? But we all know what we signed up for. Um, with that being said, watch your people, man. Watch the one that's close to you. Dude was a childhood friend. You feel me? Ten years. I've been seeing clips, several different clips of Lil Durk shouting him out in songs, saying free him. He even gave the guy fifty thousand dollars when he came home. You feel me? Like that's real. That's real, real nigga shit. Like it ain't too many people left that do that. Like whether you went to jail for the gang or you went to jail on some janky shit, I still came and gave you fifty thousand out of my pocket, at the kindness of my heart. Um, free Lil Durk. I know my fans don't like it, but we ain't. I ain't sitting here saying, "Oh, I'm Lil Durk friend." Oh, this and that. No, I'm not. I'm saying free him because I don't wish that on nobody. The system is fucked up, bro. He's still a father. He's still a black man. He's still a, 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 um, a Muslim. He's still a child of Allah. You feel me? So it's like, you know. And you don't wish that on nobody. So everybody that's celebrating that shit, it's not, it's not funny. And one more thing before I get up out of here, the fans, y'all hypocritical, y'all very hypocritical because now is this is this is this is why this is why I tell you young niggas in the interviews don't crash out because remember how all the fans, Sly for Von, Sly for Von, every post they made, remember it was Sly for Von, Sly for Von, same shit with us, Sly for Duck, Sly for Duck, you feel me? And then. You know, everything don't get bro get broadcast, you feel me? The real street niggas do street shit, and you know what you know. I'm not even talking about me, I'm talking about in general. So, y'all antagonize all that Sly for Vaughn, hashtag Sly for Vaughn, all that. And then, some shit happened, and they Sly for Vaughn, and now it's, oh, he crashed out. Oh, he's stupid. Oh, why would you do that? Why would you do that? See, the world we live in is, is fucked up because if you if you let somebody disrespect you, you you are goofy let them play with you. If you go and do something and get caught, then you a crash out. But if you go do something to a nigga, you don't get caught. Then you then you just overly rank. 
The world is fucked up. The game is fucked up. The streets is washed. Y'all see what's going on. Big Meech just came home. Welcome home, Big Meech. I ain't trying to throw no dirt, slam on nobody's name. These is accusations. They just said Big Meech told on someone to get home. The streets is washed, bro. You feel me? Like, it's bad, bro. Like, you feel me? I don't know what's going on. Um, I wish everybody the best. Um, I pray that everybody come from out of this situation with their head high. Whether they're the ops, whether they're my brothers, whether we're friends, whether we're not, whether we're cool, whether we're not, you feel me? It's still just, I'm a father and I know the responsibilities that I have, that man has too, you feel me? And he has probably 10 times more responsible, you feel me? Like, responsibilities, you feel me? So, with that being said, man, y'all, watch who y'all call y'all homie, man. These niggas are wearing wires. These niggas is not who they say they is, bro. Um... Keep the business with business. Don't mix it with the streets. Try to keep that shit away. Keep it away. You feel me, bro? Like, you feel me? You gonna do what you do? Do it. Have the street niggas do it. And the what I really wanna leave y'all with before I get up out of here. The most important message is protect the bag, brother. If this man the one that's providing for everybody, like, it shouldn't be none said about him at all, bro. Like. Y'all supposed to make sure that man is great. You feel me? Like, if he made, he made, he gave you 50000 brother. You know what he could have did with that 50000 Yeah, That's a lot of money for a street nigga that ain't had nothing. You feel me? For a nigga who was gone for 10 years. That's a lot of money. You feel me? But, you know, man, you bapping with the bapper. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this situation. Um, At the bottom, man. Man. Yeah, that's fucked up, man. Free dude, man. Y'all know that. Else.